Hey YouTube, we are going to learn some more Pokemon today, and today we are going to learn one of the most important elements of the game, and that is how to win. There are basically three ways to win the game of Pokemon. One, probably the easiest way to win, the most commonly done, is to claim all your prize cards. At the beginning of the game, you set out six prize cards. You take a prize card every time you knock out a Pokemon, and when you take the very last prize card on your side of the field, meaning you will have knocked out six Pokemon, normally speaking, then you will win. Taking your last prize card wins you the game. But there is another way to win the game. Another way to win the game, as we look at our opponent's side of the field, he's got his active Pokemon, but he doesn't have anything on the bench. You can have up to five benched Pokemon, but he doesn't have any right now. If we can knock this guy out with an attack, or in fact, if we can take him off the field in any way, but usually you'd be knocking him out, and we would take a prize card for that. Now, even though we still have one prize card to go, our opponent doesn't have a new Pokemon on his bench to replace his active Pokemon who's now gone. Since he has no Pokemon in play, he loses the game. So that's good. We won the game, because we essentially ran him out of Pokemon. So that's one more way to win the game. And there's one last way to win the game. And that is our opponent's deck. If our opponent draws this last card and he has no cards left in his deck, well... He's just about beaten, but not quite. In order to deck someone out, that is, run someone out of cards, in the game of Pokemon, it operates a little differently from some other games. You have to fail to draw a card when you're supposed to draw a card at the beginning of your turn. So, let's say my opponent only had one card left in his deck, and he activated Professor Sycamore. Professor Sycamore says that he needs to discard his hand and then draw seven. Well, he can't draw seven, he can only draw one. But he doesn't instantly lose, he just fails to draw the remainder of those seven cards, and can keep playing his turn as normal. Also, during our turn, and in between our turn and our opponent's turn, our opponent is still able to play normally. It's only when our opponent is supposed to draw a card at the beginning of his turn, and can't, that he loses, and therefore we win. Of course, we're bound by those same rules, so those are things to keep in mind. It's useful to have at least one benched Pokemon, just in case something happens to your active Pokemon. If he gets knocked out, that way we'll have somebody to take his place. Because you really don't want to get run out. Because even if you have a basic Pokemon in your hand, that's not good enough. You have to always have at least one on the field at all times. So, that's how to win the game. And until next time, like, comment, subscribe, and check out my channel for more videos on how to play Pokemon.